Well, hello there, everybody. Today, I am going to explode myself because we're playing Sapper Defuse the Bomb Simulator. So starting off, of course, we got to make our character. So welcome, Mr. Bomby McBomberson. I guess we have to choose perks as well. I feel like if this is a bomb defusal game, we should probably, you know, select bomb. It doesn't really explain much. I should mention this is a brand new game. So it might be a little rough around the edges. Oh, it does explain we have light time, whatever that may mean. Um, you know what? Pressure tolerance? Yeah, you know what? I don't want to explode. And let's be... Wow, there's two lockpicking. There's going to be a lot of lockpicking in this game. Let's pick hacking. Oh, epic music. New guy, welcome to your new office. My name is not new guy. It's Bommy McBomberson. Thank you very much. Open up the metal curtains. Let some air in. Ah, oh, you smell that air? It smells like explosives, damn it. Uh, okay, I should, I should probably be paying attention. What are you talking about already? God, you went so quick. Oh, I'm gonna guess that it's the glowing mailbox I have to start with. So why, why do we have a mailbox? Are we a thief? Grab the nuts and then take off the panels, right? Okay, we gotta take off this. Take off this. Is, it, is there a bomb in here? Why am I just sampling this? It's just kind of teaching me how I get it. Oh, they created a bomb for me to practice on. Is it a real bomb? That's all I want to know. Okay, defuse the bomb. Simple enough. We have wires. Now we have to cut, cut the color of the light. Bomb tutorial failed. Oh no. Okay, so it's not an actual bomb. That's no fun. I like pressure when I'm learning how to defuse things, damn it. God, is this all you need to do to be a bomb technician? I hope you're not colorblind, that's all, because this is really easy if you're not. Am I now fully trained? Because that was the easiest bomb I've ever seen. Oh great, there's a board that tells me how long I stayed alive for, so that tells me we're probably gonna die a few times. Okay, and this is my map, so I have to go to the city, I think it said. Sure. Sure, let's head there. Okay, rookie, be careful. Whoa, that is a fast train. So there's clicking inside this box. Should I not have like a bomb suit? Do we not have robots for this at this point? I mean, it's 2021. I guess we'll just throw the rookie in there. If he explodes, he's expendable anyways. Okay, and we got a hat. And okay, is it actually a clock or is it a bomb? It, I, I think it was literally just a clock. There's a note inside. If you're reading this, just know that you are exactly where I wanted you to be. While you've been busy setting up the perimeter and going through this box, I had enough time to place bombs in multiple places in the city. Oh, damn, the plot thickens. You may think I've lost my mind and whatnot. I didn't. That's what they all say. The abuse, too many people lost everything to this system. People will finally open their eyes and I'm the one who will turn the light on. But I'm a fair man. I scatter clues all over the city. If you find them in time, you will have a chance of finding these bombs, but don't expect it to be easy. Those clues are booby traps. Oh, great, an explosive treasure hunt. How exciting. This is not good. Y you don't say text at the bottom of the screen. Who the hell would plant bombs in the crowded place like that? A sicko, that's who, obviously. Come on, man. Look, there's a few places in the city you won't have easy access to, like the mayor's office or a construction site, for example. Am I not, like, part of the police? I may need to break inside. What kind of issues do we have with the freaking mayor? Well, I guess we get to learn how to lockpick now, so that's exciting to break into the mayor's office because he doesn't like police officers or something. I don't even know if I'm a police officer, if I'm honest, but there's police things all over the place. All right, so I've lockpicked a few games before. Um, we just gotta, you know, rotate it. First try? Oh my god, that was easy. All right, we can also learn how to be a hacker and do decryption as well. Um, okay, hacking allows you to access electronic safety systems. Got it. Done. Okay, so these are obviously first levels. <laughs> this is some decrypted content right here. Here we go. <laughs> oh god, I really hope they get harder because I should not be this good. All right, and here we are. I'm all excited to do my explosive treasure hunt. Start looking for those notes. They will lead us to these bombs. Okay, if I was a sicko, where would I hide a note? Go? Oh my god, I, this is time-based? Why? Uh, I, I guess that makes sense. It's, of course it's time-based. There's a bomber waiting for me to do this quickly. So it said trash cans and stuff. Dude, this is actually quite big. So the fact that I only have four minutes, I'm screwed. I'm going to explode. Hey, see any shady notes around here? What the hell is this? Uh, oh my god, I gotta take this apart. Okay, any notes in here? That was a huge waste of time. Fantastic. Eh, not seeing any notes. Okay, can I look at the other one, please? Do I have to really exit this to look in the other one? Jesus Christ. How the hell do I take apart an ATM? Oh, right, right here? I feel like this is a sec security issue. Uh, okay, chain link fences in there. Sweet. What the hell? What am I doing? I'm, I am not looking for notes. I'm just hacking things at this point. Check out that headline. Headless body in topless bar. 
Where the hell are the notes? And also, where are the magazines if that whole thing is empty? This whole world is a freaking lie. <gasps> what is that? I found something. That's a bomb. Okay. Please, please, please give me more time. Please give me more time. I thought I was supposed to find notes. Please light up. Chicken noodle soup. Please. Blue. Blue. Cut it. Cut. No. Cut. Okay. And can I just cut the yellow now? Okay. Uh, it's a good thing that light turned on because I don't know if that was the case or not. All right. Let's get inside here. That would be a bomb, I think. Oh. Oh, decryption time. Oh my god, I just I just failed the easiest thing ever. I see my opening. I clearly need this big of an opening because I'm not good at this. There we go. Nice view, not for long, I hope. Okay, I got extra time. Okay, so we've gained time. Oh, okay, so that's good. I thought I had to do all this in four minutes. Yeah, no thanks. Oh my god, I can pick this? All right, all right, come on, come on. There's gotta be one in here. There we go. Whew, okay. Um... Well, that's not good now, is it? There's got to be something in here, though. How the hell do I do this? Ah, ha, 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 ha! I was like, is it worth it to do this whole thing? There can't be anything behind this, but of course there was, damn it. We got another... Oh, this time it's meatballs. It's not chicken noodle soup. Okay, back to four minutes. Oh, thank God. Um, Now I know that I can kind of explore the whole freaking map. There's a box there. I feel like there's going to be something in that box. Yes, what is inside? It's another freaking clock. We've already seen this box. Did he put it out just to troll me again? Aha! Uh -huh. What is that? I see you. Get out of here. Oh, this is a different one. This is exciting. All right. What do we got in here? Oh, another one. All right. Got to decrypt. Those buildings are getting higher and higher. What the hell are you talking about? This guy is on drugs, clearly. <laughs> They're not getting any higher. What's up, food tier? <laughs> food tier. Well, this is telling me I should probably go up there, right? Oh, my God. Do I have to actually get over there? I, I don't know. I don't know anymore. I don't know what's going on in this game. Aha! Oh, man. We are adding a crazy amount of time now. This better be the last one. I'm starting to run out of places to go. Wait, what did that say? That's not good, man. If the bomb does go off in the construction site, it's going to get ugly. Oh, I should have read that. It said something about the crane, though. I already know where that is. So, get inside the construction site. Where the hell was that? I was back... Somewhere over here. So we'll just kind of retrace my steps. All right. So I sh really should have read his message. But yeah, he said something about the crane. Get inside the construction site. It's there, but that's an electric fence. Okay. So I kind of got ahead of myself. That worked out, though. Turning off the two generators should turn it off. Okay. So we have... I saw the one here. We have one over there, clearly, too. It's locked. How the hell do I unlock a generator? Oh, I wonder where the key is. God, is that... Was that always there? Or was it, is it only when I'm close? You know, I have those uh, bomb defusal superpowers. I can see through walls and everything, clearly. Okay, there... <laughs> there we go. I wouldn't have noticed it. I wouldn't have either if I didn't have see-through vision. All right, power's gone. Time to open this bad boy up. And screw this crazy bastard who tried to kill the city. Come on, give me it. Give me it. First try. Hell yeah. All right, we got 25 seconds to do four. Oh my god. Actually, this is kind of scary. Hurry up. Hurry. Okay, white. All right, and purple. There we go, with four seconds to spare. All right, just got to use my levitation powers to put these uh, do not crosses down. I don't think anybody's over there that's going to cross anyways, but okay. Man, these guys are really committed to uh, putting these safety cones up, aren't they? Jesus Christ. Well, do, do, we, do we need two layers? Also, why does the box need to be here? Why can't we just bring the box near it? All right, I said carry the bomb slowly. I, I, oh, okay. Oh, 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 I'm playing with death, baby. Run! Oh, I, I, I can actually, oh my God. I didn't, you don't even get an explosion? I guess in real life, when you do die, you probably don't witness the explosion. You just see blackness right away. But I thought I'd at least hear it, you know? All right, we're just gonna get a 2.0 there. There we go. All right, so we've learned from our mistakes. Actually, we have to be careful with these things. Oh my... I it said to click it! Okay, you just drag over to it. God, that would have been great if I would have blew up again. Okay, goodbye. I don't know where I'm storing that again. One down, keep looking. What? There's more? God, this guy is sick. I love how the graffiti just says graffiti. I just realized <laughs> you can you can find the bombs inside things if you know their placements. I wonder if there's a bomb in this one. Oh, really? You have to wait for the light. Welcome to 3.0, baby. Hopefully it's the best one. All right, so I found the final note. He said he was going to the mayor's office, so we're heading there now. Ah, uh, yes, there's the American flags. Okay, so the mayor lives here. 
It's so weird. Do I have to actually lockpick this? Like, just, just ask him to open it, you know? Hey, Mayor! You probably have a bomb in your office. The gate is locked. You have to find another way to the upper floors. Oh, really? Wait, I think I know it. The bomb has to be somewhere. Check the main rooms. Well, dude, I'm not even in yet. Hold on. You got to do some parkour here. There we go. <laughs> Yo, Mayor, you got a lot of chairs in here, my dude. Um, What am I looking for? Find the bomb. Oh, I'm, I'm looking for the bomb. Um, okay, brain, come on. There we go. We did it with seven seconds left. Now, what do I do? Oh, no, I don't want to do it again. Screw that. All right, we're going up higher now. Oh, this door is unlocked. This is the only door that's been unlocked, and it's got, like, all these files in it. I feel like this should be locked. Uh, oh, God. Here we go again. Yeah, skills to pay the bills. Twelve seconds left. That was, that was a world record right there. What the hell? It's got to be on the... Is, is it on the roof? Whoa, whoa, these are hard to climb, Jesus. It's, it's like I'm climbing on ice, holy crap. Come on, stay on there. Oh man, <laughs> this, this is an interesting parliament building. All right, I think I might've found the, the mayor's office. It's got like a reception desk out here. So we're getting somewhere. This is actually huge. So I'm glad this isn't time-based because <laughs> this dude is nuts. Oh, there it is. Oh, 25 seconds, Jesus Christ. I should probably pay, pay, pay attention. My, my question is how did this guy put the most obvious of bombs on a mayor's desk? I feel like that might be a little bit of a security issue, you know? Okay, secure the area. Here we go. Oh my God, why? Why? Like seriously, if you need to be this secure, just bring the box up there maybe? I don't know. All right, bomb, come on, man. You just gotta go for a little walk. Don't be hitting any doors or anything, okay? Do I really have to hold this like six feet in front of me too? I mean, I understand social distancing is a thing, but I don't think bombs can spread COVID. Let's hold it a little bit closer so I don't hit anything with it. Oh, jeez. Okay, come on. We're almost there. Don't drop it this time. Just put it... There we go. Okay. Okay, go back to the office. We have some info about the bomber. I'll brief you when you get there. Yeah, I'm curious to see this sick bastard. We got results from the lab. All right, let's see what this guy looks like. They found fingerprints on both the bombs. He seems like he wasn't too secure. Um, those fingerprints belong to Vincent Dorn, a factory worker and a workers' union member. There was a report in the database of the incident, including Vincent and a board member. We have to check the factory area. Oh, is he dropping more bombs there, too? All right, so it said the factory might have advanced locks, so we have a training thing for that. I think there's training things for all these now. All right, so we gotta drop the pins down. Do I have to drop them all down at the same time? Push the trigger... Move the pick. Okay. Okay, so I think I gotta hit it all the way down and then lock it in place. Not exactly how locks work, but hey, I'm not gonna question it. It's actually quite detailed, which is impressive. And there we go. We opened it up. All right, and I think we'll wrap up this episode here, guys. It's good to see that they do get more complex. Obviously, we saw the very basic of basics in this first episode. But yeah, if you guys enjoy this, I guess we can go deeper into it and see who this bombing crazy bastard is. But yeah, that's Sapper in a nutshell. I hope you guys enjoyed, as always. Thanks for watching and liking, guys. And I'll see you in the next one.